Hi everyone. Um, I've got Mohammed here. He's been helping me build the gym. So uh, we got our taekwondo, ex taekwondo expert there. He's doing some painting. Another one out there. Uh, so it's the we had some finances to give to the Hope Project. So uh, it's a lady done a marathon uh, to start with, and some other people have come in, and we we brought we brought uh, some weights, uh, some dumbbells, some spongy things. We put some here. We put some benches in, but you got the weights and skipping ropes and some dumbbells here. I mean, it's all part. It's all mixed in at the moment with all the work and stuff because we're building the area. Uh, there's some more dumbbells over there somewhere, over there. So, this is skipping ropes. There's two lifting bars there. Um, I mean, it's only a start, so we, you know, we still need to get some more things. But the lady that done the marathon, I think it was in Brighton, or uh, well, she was from Brighton in England, and she sent us £850 plus uh, the aid, the tax aid thing, um, government aid that went with it, which gave us a good start to buy the cement and buy the timbers. Another guy came in and gave us another donation. Uh, Begita from Norway, she gave us a 250 euros for the roof and the bamboo. Um, so yeah, we, we're doing pretty well. You know, we one of the lads made this up for kicking. Uh, we went up and, and brought some stuff this morning from the farm shop. Got these links. Uh, which I think they're quite good and we put a couple more links here but to put some bungees on so people can stretch their arms and things and these poles will be for a bungee as well so they will it will go around there um, and one of the guys uh, wants to build a massaging room so the other chicken hut which is this side will be the massaging room um, I mean there's a rotavator we had at the Hope, Hope Center in here because they're using the rotavator for gardening but we found another home for the rotavator and maybe we can get a bench along the side here um, and do it up as a, a masser room or some sort get all this muck out and see what we can do. Anyway, you know, it's all fairly, fairly basic, but it, it's, it's better than nothing. You know, all the boys are really enthusiastic and everything else. Uh, there's Mary Beth has been with us all day helping. Hi, Mary Beth. Hi there. <laughs> so, Mary Beth from America, uh, from Maine. Yes, Maine. So, here we go, put the gym there. So we're almost there, we're going to paint it, the building white, black doors. Um, the roof's almost finished, we could do it a bit more in the middle, a bit more bamboo. We've double lapped the bamboo, uh, crisscrossed it so it gives more shade. We need a little bit more for that top end corner. This end, because we have a volleyball court with a van sitting on at the moment, this is a volleyball court, we've uh, put wire mesh on the end here. So stop the balls coming in and hitting someone if they're lifting weights. We have 60 carpets to go down, yoga mats to go down. We've got those. So, so it's coming, slowly, slowly it's coming. Um, we're getting there. The, the furniture here came from the Hope Centre and from the stalls were from my shop. Um, so we're, we're trying to mark all the gym stuff up with gym on, otherwise it just disappears. Uh, over here we've got in the, some Nepalese guys, they're um, building, I, I, I was told it was some sort of workshop, like a wood workshop for them. And most of this has been made out of pallets, it's absolutely incredible. These guys are just unbelievable, you know, they're all bits of old timber. They're buying the pallets for three euros each, uh, and they're getting timber from anywhere they can. <laughs> Uh, we're buying some in, but uh, it's amazing. Uh, this is the, I forgot to say, this is One Happy Family, which is uh, started by uh, Swiss Cross. Uh, it's not the Swiss Red Cross, it's called Swiss Cross. So this is the children's play area here. Um, here we have a shop up and running. It's just started the last few days. Okay, how are you doing? Yeah. Good. Good. Is the shop open? Yeah. Yeah. Explain this. Explain the shop. Um, it's just a shop where they can buy for the drachma everything what we get. So all of these are donations, and yeah, they just can buy stuff whatever they want. That's they great. That's with the plastic drachma they get. Mm -hmm. the, the plastic. 
the money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. the plastic gym money. Yeah, it's yeah. like a monopoly money. Uh, they get two a day, and they can come and buy anything with one of them, or get a cup of tea, or a cup of coffee, or buy soap or shampoo and things like this. Great idea. Yeah. And this has been running what? Three days? Two days? Today. Two days. We started. I opened today. Yeah. Oh, bravo! I know. I was watching it Saturday going on while we were doing the gym. Yeah. So. You know, we just started before twenty minutes or so. Oh, there you go. Then. <laughs> I timed it just right then. So. Okay, that's that initiative. Uh, okay, cheers. Uh, here we have the main hall. Uh, so basically, we have the. Ju this is a cinema here. So, so it's like a. Okay, and they got seats and stuff here. I don't know who's here. Okay, just want to sleep in there. Okay. There we have a children's play area here. So, hey Salim. Hi Salim. How you doing? This is the the doctors and the men use this room as well, like uh, for their tea and stuff. Their their pipe tea, you know, the, the ones down there. You see, in the bottom there. Um, no alcohol or drugs. Uh, So this is coffee shop. So name What? Philippia. I in the Philippia. Ah, Philippa. Philippa. Mm. Ah, bravo. That looks good. <laughs> That's one I done when I was eating lunch. Salim, come and grab me, and uh, I don't know if you can see it. Uh, I've got peace is the solution. Shukran, 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 Eric, Achi, wa Sadiqi, Eric, and Muhabbil Salam. Hayik, Eric, the Anak, and San Musalim, and San, the Hubbil Salam, and San, the Delta Katir, and Ejlin and San, the Haita, the Katir, and Ejlin and San, and the Katarta Katir, Ya Eric, Ya Eric, and the Katwa, Philippa, Tartu Katir, wa Hatayta Katir. شكرا لكم كثيرا شكرا ثاني فيو فيليبا ثاني فيو غريب يو ويلكم سو اي دونت نو وات هي سيد بت هيز ا جود لاد هيز ذا هيد اوف ذا سيريان ديليجيشن ان موريا كامب سو هير وي هاف ذا اوفيس وي هاف ا سوين روم هير ويتش از ذس از ذا سوين روم ويتش ذي ذي ميد ذا ذا كيك بوكسينج باغ ان هير ا ذي ذي تيك اب بيبلز تراوزرز اند T-shirts and things like this, and anyone's got rips. We have a toilet there, uh, WC down there. Uh, here is the coffee and tea over here. Uh, all this, all this work here is all done by different refugees of different nationalities. The painting, the all this woodwork here, uh, all the painting of the walls and stuff. The furniture here was from the Hope Center. We 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 brought it over, and uh, this furniture here was made by the Nepalese guys out of pallets again. Unbelievable what they do. Um, here you got fresh drinking water, which I will have a drink in a minute. Uh, here they do all the washing up and stuff. Uh, out here we have different initiatives going on. So. Much money. <laughs> this man's the store man, and he takes money from everyone. <laughs> no, no. This is the storeroom. Uh, you have to come and sign this stuff in and out. Uh, as you can see, there's cranes, paints, ch children's stuff, shovels, picks, brooms, everything. And this man does the lot. So he makes sure no one pinches anything. <laughs> so uh, now the radio station's open. By the looks of it, we have a radio station up and running with Jim Jalal, I think. Uh, I'm coming in. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to come in and film the radio station. Hi. How are you doing? Okay. How are you? I'm good. You're going to be on YouTube. 
Yeah, yeah, I am you too. Yeah, how are you? Okay, great. Good. Is the radio, when's this up and running? Yeah. You up and running now uh, or not? No, not, no. it's just, um, now we just have uh, music. Okay. Yeah, in 24 hours we just, we have a playlist, it's different music. Yeah. Like, uh, Arabic music, uh, Iranian music, Afghani music. Uh, a mixture of everything. Mix, yeah. What about yeah. some rock and roll for the <laughs> yeah, English yeah, and Americans? Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But we want to start as soon as our uh, general programs. Okay. We have three kind of programs, like yeah. uh, interview program, uh, like music program, like um, news. But uh, we need some staff. <laughs> that people do <laughs> get watching in, us, yeah. Get in touch on Skype. Yeah, you could yeah. get Skype with Eleni. Good. My daughter. That's good. Yeah, she has yeah. three albums. Yeah, she can play some of her music. Yeah. Great. So, if yeah. the people they can yeah. help to radio, yeah, they can do this. Yeah, you can get in touch with Eleni on Skype. Good. Yeah, and she'll speak to you. It's yeah, great. and she'll let you play her music. I know she will. So good. It's just good. Yeah. We will. We will yeah. do this. We will yeah, do, this. do this. Yeah. Okay. And how are you? Great. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, just having a walk that's around. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. That people I'll tell Elaine okay? to get in touch with you. It's great. And we go on Skype and you can Skype her and do an interview. And yeah. Fantastic. Great. Okay. <laughs> so, we have a library. I think the library's locked at the moment. Yes, that's the library there. So, it's just coming to the end of the day now. And we have different things here. We have the schools and the art rooms and I won't go up too much because I don't know who's up in there. So there's three different rooms here. So, this is okay. so up on the roof here, we the ladies they see us putting the gym in, and, and they want something. So they're on about doing a fitness place or something like that uh, for yoga and things like that. So I will speak to Fabian and that and suggest I uh, see if the ladies can use up here I don't know how we get round it we need to put some sort of shade up here but uh, once we've got the gym up and running maybe we can do something for the for the ladies and put a gate on the bottom here there's a big area up here and it'd be ideal we've got a lot of storage up here at the moment it'd be ideal to do uh, something for the ladies it's very well protected no one's not been overlooked so as such so some sort of shade bolted in or something we can, a bamboo thing or something we can do anyway that's something for the future but, uh, okay so this is one happy family it's an amazing space incredible things go on here uh, and the refugees are doing all their own little bits and pieces they put these gardens in and flowers in uh, up through here beautiful flower garden in you know where they're stuck here in Greece they might as well do something and they're all taking great pride in here really really taking a lot of pride in what's going on here um, I say there's not that many people here at the moment normally they all get fed here during the day at lunchtime it's really packed here but we're coming to the end of the day a lot of people Down the far end there, uh, we have, they're going to put in gardens, vegetable gardens and things down the bottom end, so we can grow some vegetables. And I think we will expand the gym, uh, you know, there's areas here we need to fix, and maybe, we'll see how popular it is, but maybe we can take a bit more area in the back. So, okay, all the best everyone, bye.